I'm Natasha Lubchenko. Welcome to CT Style. We have partnered with the Goff Law Group to bring you The Law Down, a segment in which we help you navigate important legal issues. Today's topic, car insurance and what you need to know. Here to break it down for us is personal injury attorney Brooke Goff. Brooke, thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. So let's first start simple. How does car insurance work? That's, that's not a simple question. <laughs> There's nothing simple about I'm that. Mistaken. So, so, you know, we're here in the winter's coming and it's important you know your coverages, right? So most people, I've never seen an industry where that people are so willing to hand over money for something they don't even know what they have, right? So, right. I mean, I see people in the store and they're like nickel and diming over like two, three dollar differences or, hey, um, you know, this shirt doesn't have this or, or in a restaurant, this food doesn't have this and they're trying to negotiate for two or three dollars, but they're spending five thousand dollars in insurance they don't even know what it all means. So for car insurance, um, liability, it means it protects the other, well, it protects you personally, okay? Yep. So the other person, you're at fault, is gonna sue you and your liability limits are gonna protect you, okay? Liability should be very high. But why do you not value yourself as high as you value other people? So that's underinsured, uninsured motorist, right? Yep. Somebody without insurance or without enough insurance hits you, that's your chance to make up the difference. So right. if you value your yourself and your worth at $25,000 a state minimum, then the more power to you. I certainly don't, right? So you gotta take care of yourself too. So I always recommend liability in underinsured, uninsured motorist coverage. They're usually the same. Right. I, rep I recommend a minimum of 100,000, but I recommend you go as high as you can, 250. Okay. Um, umbrellas are super cheap these days. Um, you know, like I said, it's always the could, should, would until then happens and then you're like oh oh my god what can I do and then they're in my office and they're like well that person didn't have enough insurance I go yeah but a judge isn't gonna feel sorry for you because you could have gotten yourself additional insurance you know? right and I'm sure you see all the time people get into car accidents and the other driver does not have insurance and that's where this really kicks in you know where I see it a lot New Haven really Hartford New Haven the big yeah. cities you see it a lot you see I mean stolen cars Mm -hmm. Okay, um, that people don't have enough insurance. I mean, I'm telling you, the one time that you low, and I get this all the time, the one time you decide to lower your limits to save a few dollars because right. you pay off your car. That's so you what figure, happens. Yeah, it happens a week later, yep. every time. So understand, just prepare yourself. If you do that, you're probably going to be in an accident. It's right. probably going to be something where you need additional coverage and you're not going to be able to get it. You know, the, the broken legs don't happen usually when you have half a million dollars of coverage. So, I mean, that's enough for me to run around with a half a million dollars of coverage just to make sure karma doesn't get me there, right? But right. I'm telling you the $25,000 cases the $50,000 the the $100,000 it will your your if you get in an accident and somebody doesn't have enough insurance or no insurance you know you can pretty much count on you may exceed those limits and then you're going to be coming to me saying well this isn't fair well it is because they right. allowed you to buy more um, but those aren't the only coverages but those are what you need to know liability and underinsured uninsured right. motorists give yourself the gift of insurance this holiday season, right? There you Regardless go. of what you celebrate, <laughs> you can afford the Mercedes, then you, you can afford more than $100,000 of right. coverage for the Mercedes, or you can get the Honda and you can pay the 250 of coverage, right? And the umbrella, and then you'll be all set if you get in the accident. But there's also MedPay. Okay. Um, MedPay coverage is a huge coverage. Insurance rates are through the roof. I know our premiums just went up 8% in my office. Yep. Um, we ate a majority of that cost for our employees this year. We had a great year this year, but I'm telling you, they keep going up. Deductibles are going up. You're getting $10,000 deductibles, and we're seeing it every day, too. So MedPay's free medical money to pay for that deductible. Okay. So if you have an insurance deductible of $5,000, get MedPay of five grand. Pay the five grand. They'll reimburse you. I mean... It's, it's dollar by dollar. So get the med pay, it's super cheap. Get as much as you can afford. I always say at minimum of five, try to get up to 25 if you can. And um, obviously collision, we all know what that is, right? It's not right. personal injury related, yep. but um, the deductible is important, 250, 500, a um, thousand, whatever it is, whatever you can afford. I can't tell you how many people come in my office and they say, Brooke, they're like, I have full coverage. I have no idea what that means. Right. It can mean a lot of different things. Full for different coverage people. means your car's covered, you're covered, other people are covered, your insurance laps. Like, what is full coverage, right? The holiday season is here. Give yourself the gift of insurance. The Give yourself the of gift insurance. of safety. <laughs> and know that if you break your leg in an accident, you will get fully compensated for your injuries. You can't, that, there's no better gift than that. Right. The gift of insurance is certainly worthwhile, as you've explained to us today. And of course, if you'd like yeah. to learn more, you can go to golflawgroup.net for golf. Thank you, as always. Or you can give yourself the gift of golf. And that too. Right. All right. <laughs> for golf, thank Thanks. you.